What's up? It's your boy Super Mario 1990 coming at you with an Uncharted trailer reaction. This is trailer number two for the Uncharted movie. It's going to be coming out in less than two months, y'all. I think February 18th, I believe. We finally get in this Uncharted movie. Man, it's been, it's been forever because the movie has been in and out of production since like 2008. Uh, so many different directors and writers have passed on it. Mark Wahlberg at one point was actually Nate Drake. Then he turned it down. Now he's Sullivan because so much time has went by. He got to play the old cat now. So we're finally getting this movie. I'm excited about it. I remember the first trailer came out a couple of months ago. And I actually was kind of disappointed with Tom Holland and Mark Wahlberg's, I guess, like rendition of Nate Drake and Sully. It, it didn't match the games like I thought they would, like I wanted it to. But um, everything else from what I remember actually seemed good. Like from an atmosphere and from an environmental standpoint, it did look like Uncharted. Like, um, I felt like a lot of vibes from Uncharted 3 and Uncharted 4, especially like the cargo plane scene, uh, like that place with the auction and some of those like caverns and the old abandoned ships. Like a lot of it, they nailed the look really great. Like they, they did a really good job of that. And um, it seems to be going in a good direction. Like they have some things there. It's just a few things you got to look past or just know that it's not going to, match i guess the full dna of the games verbatim but there's enough there where i think it can feel like it can call itself uncharted but we'll check out this uh, second trailer and i'll give y'all my thoughts and impressions afterwards but here we go y'all uncharted trailer number two hey kid a little young for a bartender aren't you a little old for prom aren't you Everything in here. Why the map? Biggest treasure that's never been found. Five billion easy. But it's just a story. I bet it's a different. Five hundred years ago, my family found the world's biggest fortune. Then was betrayed. People have been searching for it all in vain. Both of you turning these clockwise at the same time. Fuck! Mm. Nice luck. You almost got me killed. Clockwise, Sully! Oh, it was 50 50, so I made a guess. Clearly. The foliage was in a chest about gold. There was something much more valuable. This girl <laughs> has a very tragic history. So much blood. Mm. Oh, I'm just to kill me. Oh! Ouch. Somebody had to get the cross. Like that song. Ah, here we go. Ooh. Kinda of nice. Uh oh. <laughs> She almost kind of sounded like Chloe right there. The victor is ours. How are they going to get them out of here? Mm -hmm. Is that going to work? Is that heavy enough? Oh, I guess so. It's Pirates of the Caribbean stuff. I don't know. Hey, he's wearing a shirt. <laughs> what is that thing on your face? Everybody's <laughs> right around the corner, kids. You can grow your own. Exclusively in movie theaters. Yep, okay, February 18th. Okay. This trailer looked a, it looked a little better. Um, okay, I can see... Yeah, I can see... Uh, it's kind of confirmed. Uh, Tom Holland and Mark Wahlberg kind of doing their own uh, rendition. But it actually looks like in the script that the chemistry and the banter is actually still there so i guess they are intending to go for that but it's just um tom holland and mark Wahlberg aren't gonna i guess they're not gonna imitate the characters they're just gonna like do the characters you know how they do it um you, you saw mark Wahlberg; he's just not even gonna try and get like a deep gruffy voice he's like talking like his regular self hey kid you almost got me killed and it's like 
Sully would have been more like, I ain't care, you almost turned me into a human dartboard back there. Or something like that. Like, you gotta get, like, a little gruff in you. Like, you gotta figure that out somehow, something. But I guess he's just like, nah, man, like, this is how I talk. This is how we gonna do the characters. But, um, it, it actually is looking good, though. Like, as far as everything else, like, the atmosphere, like I said, the environments... The abandoned ships, uh, Antonio Banderas, his little uh, narration they had, like the little voice and everything, he, he does seem like the typical type of villain. Um, they got like a pretty good backstory for Treasure, it seems like. I'm not really too big into like the historian part of it and all the treasures. I just like the, just like the fun, adventurous treks that they go on. And so it actually does seem like it has all of that in here. It's just... Um, it's just it just doesn't really match the greatness of the games that you're used to which to me is kind of a bummer because the uncharted series is like my second favorite gaming franchise of all time so to be waiting this long for them to do a movie and then you see it it's kind of like it looks like it's going to be nothing you know less than decent it looks like it's going to be decent it looks like, it looks like it'll be good you know at best but nothing better than that which is um kind of a bit of a letdown because i like the game so much but it does sound like it'll be fun. It does sound like it'll be decent. It's just I haven't seen anything to like really wow me or anything. But um, I'm actually still looking forward to it. I'm thinking, I'm hoping too, because maybe they have sequels planned most likely. Uh, you know how these big franchises are. You know, they'll try to like milk it out. Um, so maybe they're just doing like a bare bones kind of adaption and then you know like as they go on with the sequels maybe just get better leave room for improvement to get better and better and better they just hit you with something basic i'm thinking but you know we'll see i'm hoping that's the case but other than that i mean it, it looks nothing more than decent it not as great as i would like it to be but it, it looks all right it looks like it, it'll be good you just gotta look past the performances and look past what you're used to getting from the games because I feel like it does enough to kind of match some of its DNA, but it's not going to do it uh, verbatim. It's going to, I think performance wise, it, it's going to look different and it's going to feel like Uncharted, but not quite the same. That's what it seems like to me. But that's just how I feel about it. Let me know if y'all looking uh, forward to seeing this movie. And if you're into the Uncharted uh, gaming franchise, which was your favorite uh, Uncharted game? My favorite was 4. Um... Uh, the way I got them ranked actually is four, two, three, one. That's like in that order. Yeah, but this is your boy Super Mario 1990, and I'm out. Peace in.